welcome back. Yes, as you saw right folks, my boat got destroyed up the coast here. Right up there. Up there. So what I did is I ran down the coastline till I got to well, I got out of the the dark forest and found the, the meadows and also found the mountain up there. So I'm maybe going up there and building a base later. Or a base here at the bottom of the mountain. Probably to mine silver when I get to that point. But I brought in the workbench because I retrieved all the stuff that I needed to reconstitute my boat. There's the boat. So. Now, we can continue our trip back to our house. Down here. But I think we're going to go the long way around, I think. I want, to, I want to take a little bit of a tour and see what else I can find. So if I find anything else, I will let you know. And we're sailing into the wind, so this is going to be a little slow. It's gotten really bad. Should have took the inland route. Ooh, you know, I might need to take the inland route. Let's do that. Let's turn around. We're going to head back and take the inland route. We're not going to go around the other side of this whole island like this in this weather. Because that would be all the way around there. We're going to take this route. It's right there. And try not to wreck another boat. Let's sail here and get us a little speed. Back to that inlet before the weather gets too bad or a sea serpent shows up. Some big rollers. Yeah, some big rollers. Wow, look at that roller. What if I could actually surf one of these? Definitely gonna use this to get into the channel. Okay, this is a dangerous way of doing this under sail. Can I thread the needle? At least the water's getting less calmer. Cruising through the bayou now. Faster than I should be going. But if we're going to race these boats, I need to get good at this. So, following wind. Ooh, full sail. How fast can we take that? We are kicking along. The inland bay here can get a little rough. Let's sail. Slowing down. Water gets shallow in these between these areas. And the wind just changed direction. Let's get the bottom a little bit. Hey, and there's the home. Gonna have to put some torches out here so I can see the dock at night. 
not really the best time to be coming in. Great, got a cat coming. He's a dead. He's a dead. He's a dead. Have to stop. And we made it home. All righty. Hello and welcome back to the channel, folks. <clears throat> Excuse me there. We're back. As I showed you earlier, we had found a way of getting back and forth. We have a portal. Links us directly back to our base now. And we are now set. Geared up. We're going to put some of this stuff in some trunks here. And we are going to go take on the boss here shortly. So, waiting for the sun to come up. Sun will be rising here shortly. And we will go over in the daylight and try to stomp on the boss. So, first I gotta go find the boss, which he is right up there. I am currently here. So, I'm gonna wander my way through and make clear my path up there so I can know how to get back up there. So. Working on getting get my bow skill up because that will help. This is mostly a scouting trip. I'm always looking to gather more resources. So we'll continue on up here and we'll see what happens when we get there. <clears throat> Good morning, campers. And welcome to day 87. Today we are going to go. It's a rest, rainy day. Oh, no. Hope the weather clears up when I time I get up there. Because I don't want to fight this guy in the rain. It will not be good. If I fight him in the rain, it will not be good. Oh, yeah. That will not be good. We're headed up here to fight the Elder. Looks an awful lot like Groot. Which gives me conflict on kicking his butt. But I'm going to go do it. Or at least I'm going to attempt to. Now, I have went and scouted out the area. And I went through and eliminated um, any wandering gangs in my path and along around there, which should help keep from aggroing in a bunch of other stuff so I can concentrate on him. Because I'm doing this solo. So, I want to make sure that I don't have to be distracted more than I need to be. So that I can do the job that I came here to do. bit of a, of a run up there. Kind of just kind of wandering, taking my time because I'm hoping the weather's going to straighten out. Because I don't want to do this in the rain. My fire arrows will be completely useless. Oh, the little circles on the map are dungeons. Um, 
found a troll cave. I have not cleared any of these dungeons yet. I'm going to come back after I've beaten the boss and finish mapping out and clearing the area. I went through and cleared out any nest. Which should help keep me from aggroing more shit than I need to. Again, I am a 50 some odd year old adult male ex truck driver. I use bad language. If you have a fucking problem with that, you probably shouldn't be on my channel in the first fucking place. So, that being said, we can get on to business. <laughs> Except it is still raining. Hmm. Alright, well. I'm going to do some prep work while the rain is raining, and when the weather clears up, we'll take him on, because I am not doing this in the rain. No, not happening. I got my little bench here so I can repair my tools. Doesn't do anything good for my, uh, my bronze stuff. And I got a little chest back here that I can put this extra stuff in that I don't need on me. So that I can lighten my load up. I'm going by the trader later. Mm, the rest of it can stay. Okay. Oh, yeah. I brought a bigger shield. Hmm. Alright, folks, we just gotta wait for the weather to clear now. So we're gonna sit here and wait for the weather to clear. And I'll see you when the weather gets better. Alrighty, let's go beat the boss. Alright. <clears throat> Walk up to the altar. Make sure we have fire arrows ready. Everything is ready. We are ready. We are set. Walk up to the thing. And we got to put our offering in the fire. Right? Offering is on seven. Make our sacrifice. Back off. Where is he going to materialize? Well, he's coming to materialize or whatever. Okay, we're going to jump over here behind this rock. <laughs> I'm not going to wait for him to get up. I'm going to start laying to him now. And there come the rock vines. Oh. Okay. It's ground attack. This is when I run away. destroy everything in this forest trying to get to me. Yep, there goes that rock. That hiding place is gone. And ground attack. That hurt. Activate my power. Screaming. Oof. Oh, that was close.
Woo. He is tearing the forest to pieces. Trying to hit. He's poor spirit. You're supposed to save the forest, dummy, not destroy everything in sight. Almost halfway down. And he starts the damn ground shaking crap thing again. He doesn't like my building. Oh, oh, hit, 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 hit. Don't die, run away. Running away, running away. Ooh. He's still after me. He's still after me. He's still out there. Saw me again. Run away! Run away! Don't get hit! Don't get hit! No! 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 He's blasted this rock all to pieces. No, 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 oh, no, 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 run away, run away, run away, run away. Healing up. Yeah, he does not like that building. Wow. Running, 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 running. Do not get back to... Oh, I got him. I defeated him. I did it! Oh, yeah. Go away, you stinking vines. Go away. Go away. Did it. Whew. Wow, went through a lot of arrows. I had the swamp key. I did it. 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 I'm a dancing daddy. Here we go. All right, people. That was the boss. 
We're back at base. There's back to our portal. And we're gonna go over and hang this trophy up. Grayling. <laughs> Keep telling them I'm not giving to the charities. Alrighty. Time to place this one on the altar. And then activate his power. Two down. One, two, three to go. As there is right now. The next one. Bone Mass. I haven't found him yet, but he'll be in the swamps. In the swamps is the next place we have to go. We now have the key. And we can go to swamps and get iron. And iron will open up a whole mess more things. Alright folks, well... I may have said this earlier, but this ends this episode. Thank you for coming along. Thank you for hitting that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Tell your friends. Be safe. And I'll see you next time.